We were trying to think of another, another thing to do, and um, I think um, the, a producer at the Opera House who we'd worked with before told David about Janatella's book, Nothing, and David was very impressed with it, and he phoned me up and started telling me the story, and I just distinctly remember being so hooked by the story so quickly, I just thought, well, let's stop looking, because this is what we should do. I just think, although really frightening, bizarre, extreme things happen in nothing, I can follow it logically, psychologically, it makes perfect sense to me in terms of the individuals, in terms of the age they're at, in terms of their environment, in terms of mob mentality, um, and, the, and the way the world is now. Uh, it, it just, I mean, just talking to Yana, I, I think she didn't have a, a completely worked out scheme from the start, which I think is a really good way to work. I think the, it sounds to me like the thing grew organically and logically, and um, that, that's what I felt reading it. And I thought that offered itself up for um, a, a story to be staged very well. You know, I don't know myself how to transform it, but now because I know it has been done, I knew it was doable. And because it is very dramatic, and it is life and death matter, which I guess it lends itself well to opera. I mean, I was particularly honored, of course, with, you know, the London Royal Opera House and Blind Bond. It, it cannot be better, basically, than that. So that, for me, was, you could say, a surprise. Also because the book has not been very known in England. It's very known in some other countries in the world, but, but not here. Um, so I was very surprised that, you know, they found it and had the courage to make an opera. So.